Ooh, ooh, hello hyperspace, my name is Devontos and it's time to get hyped because the channel has reached over 300 mil- three, 300 subscribers, I was gonna say 300 million, oh jeez, I wish. So, <laughs> okay, so, um, I, had, I actually didn't have anything special planned for this, I, I, I didn't think I would actually still be on YouTube or much care much about YouTube when the time happened, but I was still making YouTube videos because it's still pretty fun, so, uh, I guess this is, I guess something kind of special for 300 subscribers, I didn't really have anything planned, I just went with it, but, um, I thought it would be actually, it would actually be pretty, I cannot talk today, I thought it would be pretty fun to get a look back on how the channel first started five years ago, because Devontos has been on YouTube for about five years, so, um, if you guys actually hear that background music, that's actually the songs I've been using as of late, because when I first started YouTube, I had some different techno music in the background, but I couldn't use it anymore because of copyright stuff, you know, YouTube was being a dick. So I kind of just had to change it to these two songs that I switched to back and forth. This one, and another one that has some kind of lady singing. Those are the, basically the only two songs I have playing in the background, because it's easier and it's copyright free and all that stuff. But back in the day, I had some other songs, and I can't use those anymore. So, uh... I want to talk about my intros and outros. Um, way back in the day, like when I first started posting gameplay, when I was posting Blacklight Retribution. Some of you guys remember that, some of you guys have no idea what I'm talking about. But uh, that shooter game, Blacklight Retribution, it was it was kind of cheap. It was one of those free games you get from the PlayStation 4. And uh, it was actually the first video game content I started uploading. And uh, we'll just, just get a look at how my first intro and my first outro was. It is so cringy. Uh, but uh, just take, take a look. The title of the video would be here, would be say something, I don't know, maybe like this. And then, after the video, this would be the outro. Ah, oh, that's so bad. It's, it's like some early 90s CGI, it's so cringy. <laughs> but, um, afterwards, uh, I started playing, I believe it was Black Ops 3. And uh, after Black Ops 3, I wanted to give the channel some more of a video game kind of theme. And I was browsing through the Share Factory because that was the only video editing software I have at the time. It actually still was the only video editing software I have at the time. It's a little basically an app for the PS4 called Share Factory, and I just used this to make all the videos. And um, I found this basically an 8 bit pixelated theme for videos. And this was my intro, outro, and uh, uh, what was it called? Title card. No, I actually didn't have an intro at the time. I actually say something cheesy in the beginning, and then comes the title card, and then comes the video, and then the outro. Just, just get a look at this. This is kind of weird. I mean, I can kind of do it today, but it just feels a little weird, but you check it out. It would start up with some Black Ops 3, or maybe some early beta Overwatch gameplay. I'd say something cheesy like, Black Ops 3 has an OP weapon, let's see what it is. And then it would instantly pop to the title card, which would be this. And then I would include those gears or any other 8-bit pixelated transaction or transition that I, I can actually, you know, fit into the video. And then I would start talking about whatever the topic was, and then comes the outro. Much better. Way better than the early 90s CGI. It's, that's not cringy. Um, I can see myself making these pixelated intros and stuff, like I used to, but I think it takes a little too much work to line up the text right and all that stuff, which is why I kind of stopped it. was putting way too much work into the intros, and just the title card especially, because I had to make sure everything fit perfectly and was aligned, and it was just too much work. So um, I kind of just stopped making those intros and sang the cheesy stuff in the beginning and the title cards and all that, and uh, I actually made my very first outro video, which was Infinite Warfare, Overwatch, and Modern Warfare Remastered. So, you guys may remember this. And um, I also included an outro song featuring some kind of copyright free techno song because at the time all the YouTubers were doing it. And I thought, hey, you know, why not, why not find my own cool techno song? And I included it. And uh, I was still kind of learning how to edit YouTube videos at the time. So uh, when you actually watch this outro video, it's it's, it's pretty good, but it just, it just needs a little bit of work. But uh, well, this was my first outro video. Some of you guys may remember this. Check it out.
It was pretty good, my first attempt at an outro video. You saw the text at the bottom was either white or black at the time. I actually didn't implement the channel colors, which is uh, red and yellow. But uh, as I, I continued making them, I, I slowly added the channel colors to the outro text. And when I first added that intro, the animation, the text animation was, wasn't present. The text just stood there. And as I continued, I started making the text, you know, wave and all that stuff. I started making slight changes here and there, but I felt like the, the techno song just didn't really fit right. And I'm, I'm more of a wacky person in real life, so that's when I put the circus music, which is the outro that I use in my most recent videos. And uh, I'll play it one more time because it's going to be the last time you're going to see this outro because I made a new one. I think it fits perfectly. It's a little shorter than the circus one because the circus song is a little too long. And well, let's check a look at the circus outro one last time. And now for the newest outro that will appear in future videos.